Hello guys, welcome to today's video. On today's video, I'm going to show you how to create your Google business page listing on your PC or let's say your desktop. Now, if you are ready to get on with it, go ahead and type in business.google.com. Once you type this in, it's going to open you to your business. Another way to actually access this is either you go to google.com, then you hit enter. Um, this is actually google.com. Then on this area where it has this four um, this menu icon which is going to load up where it has the menu icon you click on it If you click on the menu icon it's going to give you a prompt and show you different application by Google So among those application you are going to see um, Google business I think I double clicked and it just went away. So from that area you can click and have Google business open So once it opens to this side, let me just navigate back I just want to show you guys so that you actually know what I'm talking about this area right here, just before the profile icon, if you click to scroll down to where it has Google business icon. Now it's not displaying right here. That is because we have not actually accessed it for a while. So all we need to do is to click on more from Google and it's going to display everything. And then from there, we can click on Google, Google business. So once you have that open, let's get onto it. But then you can actually find the particular product right here. It's still not displaying business. I've not used business at all on this particular account. Probably that's the reason why it's not displaying it. I cannot find business anywhere. So um, it's safe for business. Let's see. Yeah, this is Google business finally. So you click on this and it's going to take you to business. That is actually a long cut. So just go ahead and open business.google.com. It's going to bring you to this area. So once you're on this area, the first thing you need to do is to click on sign in. Make sure you actually have the Gmail that you want to use to create this business logged in already. So if you have it logged in, just go ahead and click on sign in. So the first area is going to bring you after you sign in is actually your business name. So my business name, I'm going to call this Okafo. You know what? Let me say trust. Okafo. So I actually have a particular YouTube channel called Trust Okafo and i really do not want to have this now you can notice where it says customer can purchase through uh, your website um is a local store um local customer can um visit your store in person and then it's actually a service and then it says um your business makes uh makes visits to customers so um it's actually none of these two i think the um the closest one is actually this let's say it's an online retail but it's actually an, not an online retail because i do not sell anything online so i'm just going to follow that first step because actually that is the realest one so um it says um your online store i do not actually have an online store but i actually have um a youtube channel and i think um this is okay for right uh, trust okay for but um, you know what let me just go ahead and open youtube.com and then from there I am going to copy the link so what I actually want to do is to copy the link of my channel and have it display let me close this so that it won't get me confused so close this also this is where I'm working on I am just trying to share the website of um, the business so the website that I want to share is actually going to be my uh, youtube channel link so i'm just going to copy that all right i have my link copied i am going to paste that and i'm going to delete all of the things that are in front because um i just want them to access my channel and when you paste this it's going to bring it bring out your channel and that is accurate so i am going to click on next to follow up the next step now the next step you're actually going to select which category your business is so I am going to say internet now you might not have um, the appropriate one that you are we are trying to select now you notice it says internet um, internet shop internet cafe internet um, service provider internet architecture internet design interior designer sorry interior decorator international Air airport um, there is no one relating to what I'm actually doing right now. So I am going to keep looking. You know what? I am going to just say internet shop. All right. So um, you notice it says you can change and add more later. So I'm just going to say next. So it's going to go to the next page. Now on the next page, we are actually going to select our location 
and our region and country is already selected on default because it actually picked my location but if this is not your location go ahead and choose the appropriate location and it's going to display so i'm actually okay with the one i have right now so um the next thing i need to do is to enter my street so i am going to enter in the street displaying right here this is actually correct and i'm going to enter in the state and next so the next one is to enter in our phone number you already have your country region selected so um so i am done with that i'm going to click on next and this is actually important because it's going to use that to verify your business now you can notice it says get discovered by um by people in your area respond to review and all of those things if you want that just go ahead and click on continue but if you want to receive more news and more invitation tips go ahead and enable this particular feature they are going to send you some survey or pool or probably a way to improve um your business profile but i think i'm not interested in that i am going to go ahead and click on next now this is actually going to ask you a way you want to verify your business i am okay with this first option so i'm going to leave that on default if you want to select or verify your business with um your business video you can do that i am actually okay with verifying with my sms so i'm going to say that i will prefer sms but they want to choose a call so i'm going to say next so they will actually call me on my phone to verify my business so i am going to wait for the call if i didn't get it i continue making the video most of the times you don't get this call immediately sometimes you get it immediately so let's see if i am going to get it immediately all right guys so i did not receive any message or any call so i am going to decide to um do this later because i did not get it so i'm going to verify later now um there is actually not it's actually not good to verify this later because most of the times they might not send you the verification code um later because you actually did not enter it so i'm going to also skip this but for your case go ahead and enter all of this detail that i am skipping it's quite important to enter every detail that i am skipping right now because if you skip them there is actually no way for you to verify this option that we are skipping so um you can go ahead and enter in more information about your business so i'm just going to say right here um And then I'm going to click on next and this is actually going to go to the next page. Now, this next page is actually supposed to be um, me putting in a profile picture of my business, but I am going to um, photos of my business, but I'm going to skip that. So if you are verifying your business, whenever you use photos on your business, this is going to verify your business quite easily. And this is saying uh, claim 300 Naira free advertisement. What will I do with that? So I'm just going to click on skip for it to skip the business now you notice it says edit um your edit will be visible uh once you verified so i'm going to click on continue so now all of the edits that i just made are going to be visible when i continue so it's actually easy this is going to be my business and i can verify it anytime that they send the code so whenever they send the code or call me i am going to respond to the call and then i am going to enter in the code that has been sent to me right here you notice where it says enter code so once they send me the code i am going to enter in the code right here and i'm going to verify and whenever i want to edit my business i can always come here and click on edit profile and then i'm going to be able to edit my business and if i receive a message it's going to be displayed right here and i'm also going to get notification and if anytime you want to open it for the first time all you need to do is to type in business.google.com hit enter and it's going to bring you to the business dot google.com section and then you can start editing your existing business um just make sure you ignore this this is actually going to create a new business account for you so you can actually ignore all of this that is asking you to um create a new business hold on let me show you all right guys so once it loads up this way after you type in business.google.com all you need to do is to click on this icon right here where it has the google logo click on the google logo and it's going to navigate to the google 
um, section of the page which is also going to include my business for you automatically this is it right here my business and then you can notice this is actually your business click outside this is actually your business loading up so once that loads up you can actually start editing your google business or my business right here but then people can actually search for you and see you but the only thing is that once it's not actually verified you cannot appear properly or you cannot appear regularly on people's search so in order for it to be active you need to do everything to verify your account so guys thank you for watching this video if you have more questions leave it on the comment section i will see you on my next video please stay safe and peace